from kind of everywhere that, that I, I've gone in life, um, I've had certain successes. So professionally, I'm a vice president at Bank of America for fraud data science. And while I believe that would give me some fulfillment, whether that be in the professional realm or financial realm, because uh, having a nice cushy corporate banking job came with more money, it didn't really make me happy. I didn't find joy in it. And I was trying to pursue goals, trying to seek happiness in the future, rather than coming from a place uh, of abundance and being happy where I am today. So I think that's where UPOW comes from. It's a, about putting awareness on all those different areas of wellness because I was neglecting myself financially. I wasn't taking care of like, you know, making good investment decisions. I was actually doing investment decisions, but um, while it appeared to be more gambling. So I think that's where, that's where it gets tricky too, because you, you got to take care of yourself and you got to put awareness and, and be honest with yourself. And so um, besides that, I, I think what really changed my life was I hit kind of rock bottom at some point. Uh, it was a trip to New Zealand with my family. And it was like the first time my family had like a, an argument where it was like me against them. <clears throat> and that honestly was one of the best days of my life because it helped me reflect and helped me put awareness on, Hey, I got to take care of myself emotionally. I got to have a creative outlet. I got to make myself happy. So that way I can radiate from there. Mm. Uh, so I started seeing a um, psychiatrist and a coach uh, and that was an easy journey, but it was a, a journey into myself. And from there I started to become whole. Um, I, paid off about right now $40,000 worth of debt. I have $20,000 left. We'll be paying it off in, in two months. Um, I went on antidepressants. I came off of them. So much better spot. Um, emotionally, I oh, found a creative outlet. It? Wait, what'd you say? That was a fun week coming off those, wasn't it? <laughs> oh yeah, exactly. Definitely a little hazy, a little fuzzy. So I mean, we'll it definitely take a deeper dive into all those areas, but really why I wanted to start this. And like, I think Sean's a great person and somebody that is very outspoken uh, and somebody that, you know, people can, can get behind and rally behind. So, so for me, like you pal is something about having your own journey rather than going after that cushy corporate job that you think that you should have. And all these straight A's that you're supposed to be this particular person. Cause being in that confined space is not fun.